afternoon. I'm cooking again today. Can you believe it? Um, I'm cooking enchiladas. <laughs> so the pork mince that I made yesterday, I was like, you know what? Let me just keep that and freeze it because I can get the chicken out of the freezer and cook something else. So I've made these with you before, but I don't know if you remember. I kind of messed up a bit last time. I didn't really do it properly. So we're going to do it properly this time. I'm going to show you how easy it is to do these. I have some chicken breast defrosting. I don't know how much it weighs, but there's four chicken breasts there. Um, and I need onion. I'm not going to put, oh, I don't have courgette. That's the only thing. So it's just going to be chicken and onion. And then also, because I'm not doing the tacos, I'm kind of going to make a salad. So I'm just going to chop up some peppers. I'll probably use the peppers in the enchiladas as well, but I'm going to chop up some peppers use the rest of the chorizo and the halloumi and I have some tomato and lettuce in the fridge so I'm going to make a salad to go with it a bit later because it's only 1.30 now so it's a bit early but I just was like I've been so lazy today and as you can see my hair is a bit mental I've been so lazy today I basically just got out of the house at 1. I came out and had breakfast and everything and then I ended up back in bed watching TikTok. I was just, I don't know, I didn't wake up till 10 and I thought, you know what, let me just get this done. So we're going to do this now. Um, so yeah, it's just going to be like yesterday, all time lapsed and I might just stop every once in a while and explain something to you. chicken wasn't completely defrosted when I put it when I was chopping it up so that's why I've got the lid on at the moment to try and cook it through properly and then I'm going to turn it back down now and I'm going to add the sauce in and continue with the recipe like it says this is what I'm going to cook off with the halloumi for the salad so I'm going to cook that so then it's cooled and ready and I can just pop it in the salad later when everything's ready but with these, we're going to cook everything, put it all together. I'm even going to um, put the cheese and everything on top. And then that way later I can just go into the oven and then the cheese and everything can just be melted. this one because the chorizo is gonna let off a lot of fat I don't want to put a lot of oil in it so I just put like the tiniest drizzle of oil over the onions and everything just so it doesn't stick but I'm just gonna leave this on here and let it cook down and then yeah that's gonna go into the salad it'll shrink down a lot so I'm gonna see how much there is once it's shrunk down because I might end up just putting the little containers that I take food into work I might end up just putting like a little bit into a container so that I can just take it to work and have it on my break because it might be too much for the salad you never know what it looks like it just needs to go into the oven obviously the cheese is melting because it's a little bit hot I think I might just put it in the oven now and then I can just microwave it later yeah because otherwise it might get soggy and everything um, but I did it all right this time the only thing I think 
that maybe wasn't 100% right was um, the amount of water that I put into the sauce because yeah or maybe I should have put more sauce in there anyway I don't know that's the only thing the ratio but otherwise it was fine the last one I used was cheesy enchiladas this one was the classic enchiladas so it didn't have the cheese sauce that you put on top you put the tomato sauce on top which is why you mix everything to begin with so I'm going to end the vlog here oh god because I need to tidy up and I need to wash up what's in the sink and I want to make a smoothie and everything but I hope you like today's vlog I don't know I'm <laughs> cooking a lot lately so I thought I would show you guys all of my you know cooking fun and stuff because I won't be cooking for a while after um, the end of June anyways so yeah I hope you like today's vlog there'll probably be more of these coming up because I'm working on more things lots of different cuisines and flavors and everything like that so yeah give it a big thumbs up if you liked it don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell so you get notified of more amazing vlogs like this and i'll see you guys again next time bye guys